Hello everyone, hope everybody is doing good. In this tutorial, I'll be showing you how to add video to your Shopify homepage without YouTube or how to add an autoplay video on your Shopify homepage. The first thing you want to do is go into your admin page on Shopify. Once you have done that, you are going to go over to the left hand menu option and I want you to tap right where you see content. Then from the drop down menu, you are going to tap on files. After tapping on files, what I want you to do next is tap on upload file in the top right hand corner. After you have done that, you are going to select the video that you would like to add. So for example, I am going to add this MP4 video. So you'll simply select the video, then you are going to tap on open. After you have done that, you can see the video is uploading right here. So just give it a few seconds to upload. Once the video has been uploaded, I'll show you what to do next. So just give it a few seconds to upload. Also, any note taking app that you use, for example, I'm using Google Docs. This is very important. You'll need to open this in a second tab also. So once you have opened that, all you're going to do next after the video has been uploaded, you're going to simply tap on the link icon. So you'll tap on the link icon right here. As you can see, the file has been uploaded. So I'm going to tap right where you see link and I'm going to copy the link. And as I said earlier, you're going to open a second tab, a notes tab, and you're going to paste the link right there. After you have done that, you're going to go back into Shopify and you're going to tap on online store in the bottom left hand corner. After selecting online store, you're going to automatically be redirected to the themes page. And from here, you are going to tap on the three dots right beside customize. Then you are going to tap on edit code. After selecting edit code, you'll be redirected to this page. And from here, I want you to scroll down from the left hand menu option until you see sections. You are going to tap on that. Then you are going to tap on add new section. After tapping on add new section, you are going to name this home page video so you are going to type in home page video right here in the title then you are going to tap on done after you have done that you are going to see some codes right here i want you to simply copy and delete all of the codes after you have deleted all of the codes you are going to after you have deleted all of the code in this section I want you to copy and paste this code that I will be leaving in the description. So you are going to copy and paste all of this code right here. So simply copy the code. Then you are going to go back into Shopify and you are going to paste the code right here. After you have pasted the code, what I want you to do next, remember the video that I had told you to copy and paste the link in your notes. This video right here, you are going to simply copy it. Then you are going to go back and right where you see video link goes here. You are going to simply highlight that section. Then you are going to paste the code of the video that you had copied earlier. After doing that, you are going to tap on save in the top right hand corner right here. And once it has been saved, all you will need to do now, you will simply go back to exit. After you have tapped on exit, you are going to simply scroll down. You are going to stay on the themes page. Then you are going to tap on customize. After you have selected customize, you'll be led to the editor page and you'll see your home page right here. Once on your home page, you could scroll down and right where you see add section, you are going to tap right there. Then you are going to scroll down and you are going to tap on show more. After tapping on show more, you are going to scroll down until you see home page videos as you can see right here. And all you have to do is tap on it. Once you have tapped on it, you will see your video right here automatically playing as you can see right here auto play. And you can select where you would like your video to be. All you have to do is tap on it from the left hand menu option and then you can pull it to whichever section you want. 
so if i would like to move it all i have to do is tap right where you see the six dots then from there if i would like to add it to this section i can by simply tapping on the section right there and you can see that it has now moved as you can see right here it is now at the top of the page as you can see there and also if you would like to change how the video looks meaning the length or the width you can also do that so for example let me tap on save right now after it has been saved to edit it all you'll have to do is tap on exit then you'll go back into the code you'll simply tap on the three dots then you'll select edit code once you have selected edit code you'll be led back to the same page and once on the page again all you have to do right where you see width from there you could change it from a hundred percent to 50 so let's say you want it to be 50 percent then you could tap on 50 percent right there after you have done that you could tap on right where you see width again you could change that again to 50 percent and also if you would like to change the height or if you would like to change it to a particular pixel all you'll have to do instead of having the percentage sign right there you for example would put in 50 px so that's all you'll have to do then you'll tap on save after you have selected save if i were to tap on preview store in the top right hand corner you'll be able to see the changes right here so just give it a few seconds to load up once it has loaded up me scrolling down you can see that the video is smaller right now as you can see right there this is how it looks now Thank you for watching this video. If you found it helpful and informative, be sure to like and subscribe and thanks.